Hello everyone, my name is Tony, I'm from Ecliptec, here to give you a preview of the new Shift P2 Progressive Shift Light. So we have uh, the situational screens, battery voltage, RPM, or turning the lights off. If you've got any warnings, they'll show up here, there as well. On the right hand side we've got the vertical up and down buttons which get you into the menu system. So it works alphabetically, features, install, lights, screen, signal, staging and system. And I'll give you a brief look through. So you've got three multifunction outputs. Um, these are quite uh, configurable and they're designed so that they give you a lot of feedback on what's happening. So there's many different um, modes you can pick for this. But I'll show you, uh, let's just say, RPM output level. Um, so the on level, when the, the output turns on. The off level, so you can change any of these if you want. Uh, the on period for the output, uh, how long it takes before the output repeats that on, and the output frequency. Um, you can also use an internal pull-up resistor if you want. You can test the output if you want. And also view the status. Uh, staging, stall alert, cruise dimming, voltage alert. I'll give you a quick look at this. So we're at 12.4 volts. If, if I stick this over that amount, three seconds after, it's going to issue a warning. And you can cancel this if you want. And once it's cancelled, it'll stay off. Uh, however, if you scroll through the situation screens, um, you'll see it's still active. Uh, so I'm navigating through this going up and down, and then going to the right to go deeper in, and left to come out of the menu. Um, so I'll also show you in the lights menu, you've got the start RPM, the finish RPM for the lights, the display sequence you use, so there's um, quite a range of inbuilt ones. And there are also two fully custom ones. So this is just an example of what you can program yourself. Up to 15 stages. And the interface is designed so that you can go through and uh, change any of the lights for any of the stages. Um, the lights brightness. Um, so this is a, a map showing you the, what the light sensor is showing. Um, so if we get more light in, it'll increase with the, the ambient light. So with the lights, you can fully change that if you like. Suit your requirement. The RPM hysteresis, the flash rate. You can make it nice and slow, or you can make it very fast. And what else did I show you? Uh, I'll show you. I'll show you in the signal menu. So um, you can, of course, look at the voltage. All right, this is all all designed so that's easy to set up. You've got immediate feedback on what's happening. But this is the best um, scope mode. You can actually see a live scope trace of the ignition pulses coming out, and we can even zoom in. Thank you very much for watching.